talked about, oh, well, now it's two months ago, we talked about tablets. So what have you been seeing in trends in hardware? Well, I've noticed that hardware is changing uh, a lot more now towards the, uh, the touch-based systems. Uh, Windows 8 is coming out, and Windows 8 looks to be like it's going to be designed for a touch base. So uh, a lot of people are doing uh, tablets now. Tablets are getting huge. I mean, the uh, Amazon's banking on the Kindle, the Kindle Fire becoming uh, you know this this colossal thing, and uh, you still have the iPad 2, the iPhone S just was released. Um, there are several companies that are developing small form factor tablets. Uh, Samsung has the Galaxy Note coming out, which is a tablet and a phone. Uh, about a five and a five point three inch screen. It's a little bit smaller than our, than the seven inch tablets, but it's doing some inter there. A lot of people are doing some very interesting things in the tablet world, and in the technology world in general. Uh, AMD has just released a new processor um, with mixed reviews, slightly underwhelming results, but it's not horrible. Um, and it's a step in a different direction for them. So it's because it's got integrated video and on the processor, in the uh, system on the processor. So you have, they call it an APU instead of a CPU, which is pretty interesting. Um, technology is definitely changing quickly now. We'll, we'll have to see what happens in the next month or so, because this is the big scramble just before Christmas, so they can get the stuff out so people will start buying things. Uh, the big thing I see is definitely the world is headed towards the tablet. Um, not that I'm the hugest fan of tablets because I, I like my keyboard and mouse, don't get me wrong. But uh, yeah, the, the laptop and the tablet I think are the way that things are going. People like it small, compact, power saving, and uh, portable. Portability is the big thing. John Boyd just attended TechSelect in Florida and he wrote a recap article based on the conversation that was going on there and he asked the question in his article is the desktop going away and so he he noted that according to the tech data corporation the death of the desktop is being exaggerated what are your feelings on that is the desktop going away the, I have mixed feelings in regards to the desktop I think for personal use for those of us that that uh, leverage the technology for business and for for fun and gaming a desktop is still a very useful tool um, you can get more power into a box that size as opposed to a portable um, that's just the way it is um, for business use I really see the market gravitating towards a, a small form factor device um, then clients are huge now or getting there at least virtualization is the big thing so is the desktop gonna die not necessarily. There's many programs out there that need the extra horsepower you get from a desktop still. Until they come up with a design, well, I think the big thing, like I talked about with the, the processors, um, this makes a big difference because now you have a processor that has a video processor and a central processing unit on a single die that has almost the same horsepower as separate devices. The integration of these two devices together has probably progressed the whole death knell of the desktop, as they, they keep saying. It's going to happen sooner or later. Because if you can get a single device that small with that much horsepower, then you'll be able to have a laptop that can do the same thing as a desktop. Once we get there, then I'll see that I'll, I'd say that the desktop would be going away. But right now, there's still too much that needs to be done with, uh, with the desktop form factor. Any closing thoughts for this month on hardware? My biggest closing thought on the hardware this month, look to see what's happening in the next couple months. Seems a bit strange, but during this time of the year, that's exactly what you have to do if you're looking for hardware. Lots of technology changes are happening. Uh, a lot faster than they usually do, actually. So it should be an interesting next couple months.